<gasps> oh! Sh Hartley. Hartley. Hartley, 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 Hartley? Hartley. 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 Hartley, Hartley, Hartley. Hartley? Hartley. Hartley, Hartley, Hartley. You a good boy? Oh, I think so. Hartley. <gasps> Oh, shit. <laughs> I look so dumb. <laughs> ah, that's so crazy. From the same day. I hate myself, but I love the print. One, two, three, Stop four. <laughs> hey. Hey, welcome back to this segment. My name is Sheil. Um, graphic design. Let's talk about graphic design. I went to a wedding a couple weeks ago. And in the church, gorgeous church, look at all of this stained glass window work, which was amazing. But then right in that bottom right corner, I saw this. Look at this font. This font stood out to me. It's gothic, but it's also playful and modern. The colors and like all the paneling on the stained glass window mixed with that quirky fun font reminds me of Monsters, Inc. or any sort of Saul Bass title design, even some Saul Bass poster work. If you don't know who Saul Bass is, definitely check him out. But does this not look like a Monsters, Inc. cover? <laughs> but we're in this extremely biblical, extremely religious church. So I thought that was kind of fun, and I smiled at that. And then I'm sure the priest was like, we got him. He's part of the church now but I'm not. I think it's the kerning, which is the space between the letters, that gives it this funky, fun, childish feel. It looks like they tried to fit it within all the stained glass panels as well, and the R and the K going under the letters beside it. Uh, it looks really fun, and I think it's a cool juxtaposition between the heavy biblical images and this font. <laughs> Good on whoever chose this text. Oh my goodness, double segment. I live streamed, oh my god, wait. <laughs> Perfect. Last week, I made this print in the dark room. I went to the Honda Indy and Hartley took this picture of me, but I took this picture of him. And then, then I found this, then I took this picture and then I printed it live. I did a live stream. The entire live stream is there for your viewing pleasure. And then during the live stream, I gave it away. This is going to a new home, to one of you. You know who you are, you were in the comments, we were having a good time that evening. This is yours now, I'm gonna pack it up and send it over. I think this turned out beautifully. So thank you for watching. Next time I'm doing a live stream, please join in. It was a good time. You can ask more questions about darkroom printing and you'll have a chance to win the next print that I make. How's about that? Cool. Time for me to go to Calgary to take the best pictures I've ever taken, hopefully. Follow me on Instagram to see what I'm up to over there. Thanks. Bye. Hartley.